Welcome back everybody. So this week, this update was supposed to be out on Monday, but I did not see it. I just, my computer just got it uh, today. And today is uh, October 22nd, 2021. Uh, early adopters of Windows 11, which includes those of us in the tech industry, tech business. I rebuilt again, and so I, once hopefully I get my previous video out. Um, I rebuilt this old computer using um, a AMD 5600X. Uh, 30, let's see, I have 32 gigs of uh, DDR4, 3600 megahertz RAM, and a MSI B50, a 550 Tomahawk motherboard. The reason why I chose the Tomahawks or the MSI board is that I've been using them for recent builds and they've just been very, very good. Their BIOSes are literally just really great, pretty amazing actually. And so this motherboard supports uh, TPM 2.0, uh, which uh, Windows 11 officially needs to run and the CPU is on the support list. But uh, those early adopters realized that uh, AMD discovered that there would be a, that there was a performance issue in terms of gaming on uh, their Ryzen CPUs. And so we were waiting for the update and my computer just got it today at 11.21 a.m. And what we are looking for is the uh, KB5067-46 update. You want to download and install it i'm going to start to download it right now okay so it is going to download in addition amd has uh, released a so this is the one that we want this is the uh, windows 11 update of course it's the kb 500 6747 and it updates other things too and so i'm not sure if this one fixes the intel up, uh, issue where the internet explorer was uh um this is something I did realize that there are some uh, there are some applications that run slower than usual after you upgrade to Windows 11. Uh, that I did uh, actually get that I did have some issues with that, so I'm hoping that that will uh, be taken care of. Um, but otherwise, there are a list of this and you can take a look at it. Uh, just Google the update. Now another thing is that we do want to uh, download the AMD chipset driver update. So and this is the it fixes the um, uh, level 3 cache latency issue and so what you want to do is uh, go to AMD's website and this is the chipset driver that you want you want the chipset driver release uh, this is the earliest one I believe uh, 3.10.08.506 and you just want to go on the AMD's website and find that and I already have done that uh, you go there and you look for uh, you know motherboard support and I have the B550 of course and you'll see here that You'll see there, there is Windows 11 64 bit, and this should be the first and only edition that I see it. It was released uh, yesterday, or so, um, because today is the uh, 22nd, and this is the 21st. And so, 53 in the driver, and it's a Threadripper, third gen, uh, the A series, uh, and the chipsets. So, we wanna, what we wanna do is we wanna download that and we'll let that download and it'll download and install that and hopefully that will actually take care of all our issues so if uh, i notice something really really big or substantial i'll do a follow-up video but otherwise i just wanted to uh, get this out there for all of you guys who may have a uh, ryzen cpu that's on the supported list and you know you have this issue here or i'm not sure this uh i didn't go back but maybe this says uh um it does it does go all the way back to the a series so it does go back to the a320 chipset through uh b5 b350 b450 x470 x570 and the a520 and of course the uh trx40 and the wrx8 uh, x80 i'm sorry so you do want to download this uh to you know stop these uh performance issues but thanks for watching everybody any questions or comments, please post them at the bottom of the video.